Good morning, Institube. I hope we are live across all our platforms. We should have uh, Facebook and YouTube going at once here. Fingers crossed it is being received across the uh, multiple platforms. Let's see if I get any notifications through. Okay, yeah, brilliant. We're at least live on Facebook anyway. This is on YouTube as well. Superb. So today we are going to do a homemade Mackey's brekkie. So basically, if you love your bacon and egg muffins, then you're going to love this one today. So what I have got for the recipe today is I've got four bacon medallions now taken off. Oh, you can buy them as medallions, but less fat, so more protein, keeps the calories low for you. I am going to use a couple of these for me today because I'm going to have these across two of the muffins. However, the recipe is for one whole muffin and you use all the four rashers on there. Total calories for this recipe are 287 with 22 grams of protein, 17 grams of carbs and 14 and a half grams of fat. So because we are cooking the mushrooms in vegetable stock and then we're going to boil the eggs in our special way, I'll show you how to do them as well. This keeps the calories a bit lower rather than using things like butter to cook the mushrooms and the tomatoes and then frying the eggs. So, okay, so making these little changes will make the difference when you are making your breakfast. Um, so what we'll do first of all is we're going to grill the bacon on each side two to three minutes. Okay, so I preheated the grill. If you need to turn your grill on, that's fine. Now, if you don't have a grill, um, something like a griddle or a non-stick pan without any uh, any oil and you can cook them in that because you are trying to keep the fat content low. So I will just pop my bacon medallions on here and what I've also got is I've got a pot of boiling water. So if you want to set yourself a pot of boiling water to be underway Either you can boil the kettle or you can just pop it on the hob, wait for it to boil. And then we'll start the eggs. All right, so two to three minutes on each side. I've got the grill on high there. And I've got a pan there for the mushrooms. We're going to cook the mushrooms in that pan. So I'll give you a second to catch up with the boiling water there. I'm just gonna set a timer on that for two minutes for the bacon to turn over. And then we can change that. So, what we're gonna do with the eggs, we're gonna pop them in to the boiling water hole. All right, so with the shell on and everything like that. So once it's boiling, we pop them in. now. The way to get these eggs cooked really well is we're going to set a timer for six minutes. So they've just gone in, the water's boiling. I'm going to set another timer for six minutes. And we're going to wait for them. Now with the eggs, always important to cool them. A lot of people make the mistake when they've finished cooking the eggs is they uh, try to peel them whilst they're still warm. So we've got to run them under cold water when they're done in order to cool the eggs, stop them cooking. And then when we peel them, you'll see hopefully that the eggs will turn um, firm on the outside, but you'll still have that runny yolk on the inside. And that's the way I like them really, uh, runny on the inside, but a nice um, solid white on the outside. Now it's up to you. If you do prefer your eggs hard boiled, then just add another couple of minutes onto them and then you should have a hard boiled egg after that. All right. So we've also got uh, a mushroom, chopped large mushroom, chopped, and I've got two tomatoes here, just chopped in half. What we're gonna do is we're gonna cook the bacon first of all. Once that bacon's cooked, I'm then gonna put the tomatoes under the grill as well, and then they're gonna be grilled to go on top. So I'm just going to cut in half these uh, muffins, they're not McDonald's ones, they're ours. And then, let me just get the, uh, 
Red knife. I'm sure a lot of people will enjoy this recipe because it's uh, definitely one of the Mackey's meals I enjoy, a Mackey's breakfast. It is, it is a good one, that's for sure. So I'm just going to cut these in half. We're going to toast them. Now it's up to you with the eggs. If you don't want to do them like this, you can poach them. I always find though you lose so much of the egg white when you poach an egg. If you don't get it right, I mean, you're meant to use a little bit of cider vinegar or white wine vinegar, something like that. Stir it and then the egg binds together a little bit better. However, I just find you get much better eggs doing them this way. And uh, they always cook pretty well every time. Okay, so we've got three seconds left on that bacon. I'm going to flip it over. Time is just going to go there. There we go. So I'm just going to change this now. I've just got a pair of tongs there. All right, so I'm starting to cook well. And like I say, you won't see anywhere near as much fat coming off those as you normally would if you've just got medallions. If you do use full rations of bacon then you'll find that the calories are going to be that little bit higher. So just be aware that you understand how many calories it is if you are counting them and making sure that you're within your target for the day for example. So while that's just finishing off what I'm going to do I have got some vegetable stock here just two tablespoons of vegetable stock. So instead of cooking the mushrooms in butter, like I said, we're going to cook them in vegetable stock in a non-stick saucepan. That way you get a really nice flavour. But like I say, only two tablespoons because we don't want the mushrooms to get um, too moist and then ruin the muffin. So, I'll just pop that in there. And then we'll pop the mushrooms in as well. So very important, don't crowd the mushrooms. Make sure you don't crowd the mushrooms. How long have we got on them eggs? So them eggs have got a couple of minutes, all right? So it's all, it's just trying to time it all together so we can bring it all together when cooked. Now, I won't be able to see any comments on here today. I think I'm trying to stream across multiple platforms, so it takes away any comments because it can't pull the feed in from each of the streaming channels. So, if you have any comments and you are commenting on our channel and please leave them there. I will get back to you after the live and answer any questions that you've got at all. So these mushrooms smell amazing. I don't know if you've ever cooked with chicken and um, vegetable stock before with, with your mushrooms, but it's just a really good way to get a nice flavour and keeping those calories nice and low. All right, I'm just going to take, turn that down a little bit so we don't want to burn them. This is very close to being cooked. 20 seconds on these eggs. So we're going to be prepared to turn that down while I'm going to be just cooling those eggs as I don't want to burn the mushrooms and I've got another minute on there so this should all fall into place pretty well. Three, two, one. All right, that's the beeper. So I'm going to run this under cold water now. So really important to cool the eggs as quick as you can. So we're going to cool them, run under cold water. And then if you've seen me doing the... Uh, 
a little egg hack on my social media profile this last week or so, then you'll already know what's going on. If you've not seen it, then I will show you because it's always great. So grab the eggs, they're cooled. Take a spoon, just try and get the spoon around the shell to peel it. And then once you've gone all the way around the shell, you should be able to get the egg out in pretty much one piece. As you can see there, done all right, we've done all right. Okay, so we've got another second on there. All right, so that's the bacon. So what I'm gonna do, because that's still in the cold water in there, so that's not gonna be cooking anymore. All right, I'm gonna take the bacon out, and I'm gonna leave that to rest for us. All right, so I'm gonna leave that to rest on the side there. Pop that back on there. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop these tomatoes under that grill. As we just wanna grill these off. Grilled tomatoes are great. And tomatoes are one of the foods, once you cook them, they, they release more nutrients. So, always good to cook your tomatoes with your breakfast. Okay, so, these mushrooms are pretty much done. I'm gonna take them off the heat, and I'm just gonna leave them to rest with the bacon for a minute. And then we're gonna pop on the muffins in the toaster. Like I said, I'm gonna have a couple, but on our calorie splits, it is for just one muffin. So be aware if you're adding an extra muffin, you'll be adding another 100 odd calories onto the total meal. Okay, bacon just resting there at the side. I will peel this other egg. So this egg hack's just a game changer. If you've never done this before, then get on it, get on it. There we go. All right, so we'll just pop the shells back in here. And then, actually, so you can see on here, I've just almost broken that one. But if you can see there, firm on the outside, but we have a nice runny yolk in the middle. I've just broken that one, but once I pop that, that will uh, run all down the muffin. Okay, so tomatoes are grilling nice and well. Loving these lighter mornings now. It's just feeling that little bit warmer outside. And five weeks tomorrow, we're back open in the studio. Can't wait to have everyone back in there. Really miss trading everyone inside, but we've done amazing with making it work and keeping on top of uh, everyone's fitness and health goals because we've been training people, I say it online, and uh, some people braving the weather all the way through January and February outside. So it's been really good with our clients. Really, really enjoyed it. So it's um, a great community we've got. I'm really pleased everyone's put their faith in us to keep them on track with their goals. So yeah, it's been, been superb. So we have got literally another 60 seconds or so, and then we'll start to prepare these. Let's just check on these. Nice. Right, I'm just gonna turn them over, get, get a nice grill on both sides. 
good to grill the tomatoes as well, just so you uh, soften them up a little bit and they uh, they go really well on the muffin then. Making sure these are cooking well, looking about right. We're nearly there, we're nearly there. So we've got a little bit of salt and pepper to add some flavour afterwards. So, one, two, three, four. Now, no butter, no butter going on these. Don't need to use any butter at all. All right. Let's start to build these out. So like I say, I'm using a couple of rashers on each. So one, two, one, two. As you can see, the medallions go really well as well on the muffin, really easy to use. And then let's pop some mushrooms on each one. So you get a really good consistency of the mushrooms, cooking them in that vegetable stock, and you get a nice flavour coming through. Just adds a good, good flavour, good texture. Now, are we ready? I'm going to put one egg on. If it stays on there, stay in the middle. Two egg on. Okay, here we go. And then, we're going to do the famous egg cutting technique. So if we get if we get a knife and we cut that down the middle. Nice. And look at that guys, look at that. Fantastic. And then this one. Oh, there you go. Lovely. So we'll put that onto one side. Wait, it's going rolling off. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Look at that, will it stay on now? That's the question, that's the question. There we go. All right, and then, watch my hand a second. We are nearly there. Final piece of the puzzle. Let's see if these tomatoes have got a nice little uh, chop, chopy color on them, lovely, lovely jubbly. So a little, <laughs> Maybe caught them a little bit there. Caught the tops just a little bit, but it's all good. It's all good in the hood. So we'll just take the outer edge off the tomato there. But other than that, let's pop these on the top. So one and two, yeah, why not? Bit of, bit of crispiness there. It's all, all part of the flavor. Why not? Get on there, happy days. Right, let's just move this back over here. I'll turn off the grill and then I'm just going to pop a little bit of pepper on the top of each. And there you have it, guys. Your homemade Mackey's breakfast. Your bacon and egg Mac muffins. So if you pop, pop that lid on. There you go. All right, if you are getting involved and you're giving them a try, then please post your pictures, post your comments below and let us know how you got on, let us know how it tastes. I'm going to log off now and enjoy my breakfast as I can't wait to tuck into that. Been waiting all morning for that. All right, well, thank you for tuning in, everyone. Please leave a like, give it a share and... Uh, if you think any of your friends might like it, tag them in the posts as well. And that is it. So I will catch up with you through the week. But make sure you tune in next Sunday for another cook along. We'll go live again. And I look forward to seeing you next time. Thank you very much for joining. 
Take care, everyone. Ciao for now.